Hello and welcome back to another episode on Life Afloat. You join me on the bow of the boat today on a rather windy um, and cloudy summer's day apparently. Hopefully the wind is not affecting the microphone too much, uh, making lots of interference. Um, hopefully you can hear me okay. Today's video is just a quick one, just to give you an update on how the painting of Round the Bend is coming along. I'm quite pleased with it. Um, it's a nice spot here to paint the boat. I've got no trees overhanging the boat on the towpath side. The towpath is quieter than it is in a lot of places and it's tarmac as well. So I've got no dust being blown up onto the wet paint, nothing falling off the trees and that sort of thing. So it's going on quite well. There's a few bugs that get stuck in the wet paint, of course, but nothing that a uh, little light sanding down the polish up on the sun uh, can't cope with. Um, so let me take you um, around the boat. I'll show you the bow of the boat, how that's come on, and I'll show you down the side, which has had just one coat so far. But uh, I'm quite pleased with how it's coming on, so I'll show you that now. So here we have the bow of the boat. Um, you see my previous videos, you will have known it was completely black before. So I've done blue around the bottom, black on the gas lock and lid, blue hinges, uh, blue on that bit there on the front that holds the, um, the fender and where the rope ties to. Can't remember what that's called at the moment. So um, I think that's looking quite nice. It's gone on pretty well. That's that's pretty much done. I've just got to touch up a couple of spots on the blue um, and then that will be sorted. Uh, I was going to just go around and show you the side, but our friends have arrived. These have been visiting the boat every evening, pretty much. They've got six signets. And every evening they come and knock on the side hatch, asking for a bit of food. So this is the side of the bow. Um, I'm just going to do the gloss black above and below the blue to tidy up the curve. And then that should be looking pretty good touch up the blue on the front there because I've come through a few locks and I've not had the fender on the front so it's had a bit of a knock so I've got to touch up the blue there but once all the lines are nice and clean and crisp that'll be looking quite nice and I'll do gloss black all the way down above the first rubbin strake uh, on the side as well all right so here we are on the, the side this has had uh, one coat so far, I spent two days sanding, filling and sanding again and then I did a coat of paint the other day which took three and a half hours to put on um, and it's gone on pretty well, quite pleased with it. Uh, I don't know if the camera's picking that up but there's quite a good reflection in the paintwork. It does need a, a second coat but I've got to give it a sand down first uh, just to get a bit of little bit of dust and uh, a few bugs off to flatten it out and give it another coat and then I can touch it around the windows and around the, uh, the steps here and then I've got to do the gunnel as well. So guys there we have it, just a quick video to give you that update and share the progress with you. I really hope the wind hasn't made too much uh, noise on the microphone um, and that you can hear me okay. But yeah, just wanted to show you how it's going really. Um, if you haven't already done so, please do subscribe uh, to the channel, give this video a thumbs up and feel free to comment on your thoughts of the boat, how it's coming along, any tips, pointers, things you would do differently. Um, and also if you want to support me or the channel further, then you can check out my Patreon page. Uh, of which there is a link to in the description below the video. Take a look at that and see what I can offer you in return for your support. But until next time, thank you very much for watching. Take care of yourselves and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.